morning everybody welcome back to my channel unless you're new then hello my name is Tori so in case you guys aren't aware Christmas is coming up and it's one of my favorite times of the year across the board second to Halloween Halloween is probably my all-time favorite holiday since it's very close to Christmas I did want to make some holiday themed videos so today I'm going to be making some custom shoes I really like Nightmare Before Christmas as you can tell it's it's probably one of my favorite movies like let's be honest here so for this year I wanted to make a bunch of different Nightmare Before Christmas hacks slash decor items slash like clothing items. To start off I am going to go ahead and be making a pair of Sally shoes. Originally I got this idea from Vans. They made a bunch of Nightmare Before Christmas like shoes that I thought were super cute however it was a little bit too late for me to buy some Nightmare Before Christmas shoes so instead I decided to make my own. So I went to Walmart and I bought some just plain white shoes and now I'm going to paint them. I actually painted them earlier however since it took a little bit longer originally I was going to do one video with a bunch of Nightmare Before Christmas decor things however when I was doing these shoes it took a lot longer so I wanted to at least do a separate video for these shoes so I did already paint them so let's go ahead and uh, start painting. So for this one you're going to need a pair of shoes, some paint brushes as well as your choice of paint. Since I'm doing Sally's like clothing outfit I just pick paints that were very similar to hers. You also need something to put your paints on so I just use this little cardboard. So I'm going to go ahead and start with the yellow. So I painted this little section yellow. So for this shoe, I'm actually going to go ahead and paint this little back section yellow. And then we are also going to go ahead and paint this whole section. So now that we have this yellow color done, we're going to go ahead and move on to this blue color. So for this shoe, I'm going to just go ahead and paint this big section. Get your butt out of the way! So now I've finished this blue color, so now I'm going to go ahead and add some pink to it. So since this pink is a little bit on the warm side, I'm going to go ahead and add some purple to it just to cool it down a little bit.
So I'm gonna go ahead and let these dry for 10 to 20 minutes and then I'll be right back. So I did let the shoes dry off a little bit. Now I'm gonna go ahead and outline it in black to help create more of the Sally effect of as if everything was stitched together. So I just finished outlining the shoes in black, so I'm going to go ahead and let this dry for another 5 to 10 minutes, and then I'm going to keep on adding some more detail to the rest of the shoe. Hi guys, it's Edda Victoria. So apparently I didn't record me actually decorating the shoes, which makes me really sad because I, I tried really hard on these shoes. So I don't have the footage of me actually decorating them. However, I do have the very, very end bit where I was putting the final touches on the shoes. I, I really wanted to make this video very nice and very, just very, very good. But I just, I guess I didn't hit the record button before I started painting on the shoes. So that's why most of the shoes are already decorated when you see this next, next little portion of the video. So I hope you guys are enjoying it so far. And um, peace, peace, keys, dudes. Bye. Now that I have the base of the shoe done, I'm going to go ahead and add some little stitching throughout the entire outline of it to add a little bit more of the Sally feel to it. I just finished adding all the little stitching to it. I think these turned out really cute and I'm really proud of them, especially for me being not a painter. I'm gonna go ahead and let these dry for a little bit and then I'm going to go ahead and try them on. So this is what the shoes ended up looking like. I think they're super cute. I really like them. I do think I can go back and redo little bits of this and fill in like the black a little bit more here. And just overall put a little bit more detailing in it. However, I think these are super cute. I, I really like them. I, I, I absolutely love these shoes. These shoes were not that hard to make as long as you are patient and you do not mind painting shoes for like three hours. I am very interested to see if these hold up on water and all that type of stuff. I don't think they're going to, so I'm, I'm not gonna push my luck here. I'm just gonna leave these very dry and not 
get them wet with water. So I hope you guys liked that video. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button if you aren't already. If you do want to watch some of my other craft videos, I have a bunch of them in a playlist right here. Or if you want to watch some of my favorite videos on my channel, you could click over here. Also, in case you guys don't know, I am selling some scrunchies for Christmas. So if you want to get a handmade scrunchie from me, click over here. I hope you guys are having a fantastic day and I'll see y'all later. Bye!